we are going to discuss about vector solution. My name is Dana Hassan and I will introduce to you vector solution. Let's start. We have seen how adding two or more vectors can yield a single resultant vector. The resultant has the same effect as the original vectors. If you are given a single vector, can you think of this resultant of two vectors? It is possible to start with a single vector and get two new vectors in directions that are perpendicular to each other. These two vectors are called the rectangular components of the single vector. The process of finding the magnitudes of the components in certain directions is called vector solution. Trigonometry can be used to find the magnitudes of, the, of these perpendicular vector components. Hi, I'm Kitas. Today, I'm going to discuss the formulas we're going to use in vector resolution. The formulas are sine angel is equal to opposite over hypotenuse. And cosine angel is equal to adjacent over hypotenuse. And tangent angel is equal to opposite over adjacent. These formulas are also known as Sokatoa. S stands for sine, O stands for opposite, and H stands for hypotenuse. C stands for cosine, A stands for adjacent, H stands for hypotenuse, T stands for tangent, O stands for opposite, and A stands for adjacent. As you can see, in this illustration, there is a right action. A represents for opposite, B represents for adjacent, and C represents the hypotenuse. I'm R.C. Buff, and I'm here, to, I'm here today to teach you how to solve your problem using vector resolution. As you can see in this illustration, A and B is missing. To solve for A, first write sign. And then 15 degrees. Multiply by 30. Now, first Using your own calculator, press C, and then the degrees, 15, and then you get 0.23, multiplied by 30. Now, you will, mo you will multiply 0.23 to 30. When we, when, we, when we multiply both numbers, we get 7.8. And then, cosine equals B over C. And then B equals cosine multiplied by C. Our cosine is 15 degrees. And our C is 30. The cosine is 15 degrees and the C is 30. To solve this solution, to solve this problem, press cosine and then 15 degrees. We get 0.97 multiplied by 30. The answer is 
as you can see, we already we already now get the value for A and for B. The, va the value for our letter A is 7.8, while the value for our letter B is 29.1. Now for checking. The solution for our checking is dr equals square root of a squared plus b squared. As you can remember, the value for our letter A is 7.8. And our value for letter B is 29.1. Our two values must be squared. And the next step, you must square both. The answer for 7.8 squared is 60.84 while in 29.1 is 846.81 now we must add both numbers Sixty point eighty four plus eight hundred forty six point eighty one. The answer is nine hundred seven point sixty five square. And then the answer must be square. We must we must cancel the square side. Nine hundred seven point sixty five. The answer is thirty point twelve. Now we will go on in solving a tangent. To solve a tangent, angle is equal to tan negative 1 equals 7.8 divided by 29.1. The answer is 0.268. will become 0 0.27 and then 0 0.27 press shift time the answer is 15.10 degrees as you can see 15.10 degrees is is near to 15 degrees. Now, we are done in solving our vector resolution. I hope, I hope you learned from our tutorial. Thanks for watching.